Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man X2. This time, it's time for Boss Rush! Because, well, it's a Mega Man game. It wouldn't be a Mega Man game if we didn't have to kill all the bosses over again. Sure you can! Nope, sure you can! Ah, oh, shit. I failed at it. That's kind of expected, though. So, like I said before when I fought this guy, and he stole all my abilities, he's weak to Silk Shot. And it helps if I'm not missing. Oh, that's not cool. Not allowed to do that much damage to me. Come on, hit him. Good. And predict. Awesome. Yeah, the best way to get this guy is to predict where he's gonna go, try and shoot him right as he's appearing, or know the corner he's going to and shoot the diagonal opposite of it. That way, the little shard from your attack is gonna blow out there and hit him. And see, just like that. And just jump his stupid shurikens. Or whatever the hell they're supposed to be. I'm telling you, this guy's a freaking ninja. So, they are shurikens. I mean, look at that. They have four points, they spin, and they kind of go wherever he wants them to. Are you sure they have a... Okay. Really embarrassing to keep getting hit by that. And I'm not going to have enough health to sure you can the next guy, am I? It sure doesn't look like I will. Okay. And I want to get... One last hit on I. There we are. Big, sill, trashy punch to the face. Oh, I'm gonna have to find a quick way to kill these guys because that took way too long. Oh, come on. Get around here. I want to get the health because hopefully. Nah, I'm not gonna get quite to it. Oh, look at that. One point off. Lame. Oh, and of course, it's the next guy who takes forever. Come on. Shoot your crap at me. Going for the fast way to kill him. You know, the Axe Buster. Because, like I mentioned, you know, when I fought this guy so long ago, whenever you use his weakness, he ducks away. But, right when he's going to do... Right after he does that attack, he goes away anyhow, so that's why I quickly switched to get one more hit in of, you know, more than one point of damage on him. Whoa. Was not real sure when that shot was going to come out. I didn't expect it to be that close to the wall either. That's okay. What are you going to do? You're going to do that. Well, then I'm going to do this in response. Ha! Ah, take that. And we've almost got him. Few more hits and he'll be down. Oh, I hate this fight though. It drags on needlessly long. Okay, finally. He blows up, his little wheel goes flying all over the place. It's completely ineffective. Pretty explosion. Nice fireworks. GG. Okay. Next. Ah, uh, Overdrive Ostrich. He's weak to the crystal weapon. But we'll see if we can't do something else to him. Come on, get away, get away, get away, sure you can... Yes! Look at that! Ah, crap, I took a hit. That's okay. I mean, I got one sure you can off on him, at least. <laughs> wow, that's a awkward way to jump. I guess he always jumps to you, no matter which, where you are, but he won't bother to turn around, so he jumps backwards. <laughs> oh well, that worked out pretty well. Yeah, I am in no means, and by no means, a speedrunner of this game. So, hopefully I can get rid of these guys in 10 minutes to make one YouTube video. Fuck! Crystal, well, I guess it doesn't matter. I had to fight him anyway. But Crystal Snail's probably going to take the longest of all these guys. Let's see. Use Magnet Mine. Oh, there we go. Now, if you dash into his shell, you can actually play Keep Away with it. Ah, shit. Shit! This is not allowed. So this is not allowed. Jackass. Get out of there. Come on. 
Oh, what? I missed! It hit the floor before it hit him. Ah, that was really bad. Come on, we almost took you out real quick. No, take damage. I hit your shell. Nope. Ah, crap! Gotcha. Right in the foot. What? What? He must have some slight invincibility frames as soon as he gets into his shell then. Because that didn't make any sense. Shot him right in the face. And he didn't take the damage. Or fall out of a shell. Anyway. Wow. That sucked. Look at all that damage I took from that stupid bastard. Okay, next. I'm not going to be able to show you can this one. Oh, this is one where it's really helpful to show you can. Oh, there we go. Fire. More fire. Whoa, whoa. More fire. More fire. I like fire. Fire is really helpful. And... Oh no, I took a damage. Cool, now he's going to do his other form. I'm going to charge up again, just because I like dashing through him for damage. That looks pretty cool. Oh, hey, don't run away. Brah! Ow. Yeah, the Morth Moth form still does a ton of damage, though. I could use the E-Tank, just to get my sure you can tower back. I... I don't know. I might. Considering we have like three minutes to get through the rest of this, sure, whatever. With any luck, I can, you know, sure you can this guy without taking damage. Well, that's a awkward way to hit the sure you can. Oh, screw you too! No, 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 no! Get back down here! I say get back down here. You're taking water water beats fire, and I'm not grass, so you're going to go down real fucking fast. Yeah, I don't know where that came from. It wasn't really meant to be a rhyme. I was just thinking about Pokemon, because, well, those are really fun games. And got him. Ha. Yeah, bubbles really destroy uh, Flamestag there. I don't know why he still explodes when he blows up, since he was fire. I guess he is a robot, like, violin. But, oh well. Oh crab. I'm surprised it let me pause. Usually it doesn't let you change weapons and in boss intros. Fight this guy. Well, I guess sort of the same way you did before. I mean, at least the sh bubble shield doesn't mean anything to you now. Because, you know, the wheel goes right through it. Come on. Oh, wow, that was really good. Got, like, what, three hits on them? It's hard to get more than one hit in per wheel. But it doesn't matter, because he's so slow, you can be guaranteed a free shot if you're using it right next to him. Alternatively, you could try and drop him on his head, but... I just don't feel like that's a wise tactic. So, is there one or two left? Whoa, 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 whoa. Jump! Looks like just one. Cool. Let's grab the health real fast. Maybe I can make this a real quick fight, because it's, it's Wire Sponge, isn't it? I hate Wire Sponge. I hate trying to sure you can him. Ooh, but I got it! Yeah, I don't feel like showing off the other way of fighting him. Because we are running out of time real quick. Oh no! The whole facility's going up in smoke and explosions! What the hell's going on? Sigmar! Like we didn't see this coming. Yeah, they failed. What do you expect? Okay. And now we leave and get that password we can't use because we're at the end of the game. 
we don't want to save the game because it won't matter because it's just like entering the password. And there we go. That is the end of Sigma Stage 3. And I don't have time for any more of these shenanigans. We are running out of time. So, in the next episode, we're going to go and put Sigma down. Hopefully for good, but considering that there are six more games made after this, I don't really think Sigma's staying down for good. Anticlimactic ending, next time!